Hey, it's Philip here. You're very welcome to today's Twyford tip. Today, I'm going to show you how you can use a relevant prompt in chat GPT to actually create multiple tips that might be relevant for your business and then bring those tips into Canva, where with the click of a button, you can create multiple pieces of content. This is a massive time saver if you're trying to create bulk loads of content for your client and audience. So stay tuned. This is how you do it. Okay, so I'm over here on Chat GPT, and I want to, I'm pretending that I'm going to be a fitness expert for the purpose of this tutorial. So I've asked Chat GPT to act as a fitness expert and give me 10 key tips for men over 50 to help them maintain muscle mass and stay fit. And these are the key 10 tips that it has given me. And obviously, if you were doing this for real, for your own business, you'd want to check that these tips are pertinent, relevant, and obviously accurate. But for the purpose of this, let's go with these 10 tips that have been suggested. First thing is you're going to copy those and you're going to create a, um, a fitness CSV. Um, now, the first thing is I've opened up is created a Google Sheet. I have here in the first column fitness tips for over 50 men bulk edit and then I copied and pasted in my tips. So once you have that done, you're going to download this as a CSV. That's an important thing to allow you to use the Canva bulk edit. So here it's going to save it in my folder. And the next stage is we go to Canva. Now I created this little fitness image. Um, fit at 50 and I have obviously my little text box here where I'm going to do the the merge for the tips. Now just be mindful that the bulk create edit function in Canva is for pro users only. So if you're not using Canva Pro at the moment, I would recommend that you upgrade either to the monthly fee. I think it's only about 10 or $12 a month and it's even cheaper if you buy the package annually. There's way too many upgrades and tools and fantastic functions. It's too good to ignore. So definitely, if you're not on the Canva Pro level, I would recommend you upgrade now. So if you look over here on the bottom left, you'll see bulk create. So we're going to click bulk create and you are brought to this. It asks you to add your data. Now you can add your data either manually or in my case, let's upload the CSV that we created. So select my CSV and I open and you can see it is reading. Obviously, there is my fitness tips for over 50 men bulk edit. And there I can see the first point or tip underneath. Now it's asked me to connect the data to an element. So here's my element here. Um, you right click on your mouse and you select connect data. And there I have connected the data. So the next stage is, and don't worry, this fitness tips for over 50 men bulk edit, that doesn't get replicated. Uh, you'll see now when I actually click continue, it only actually brings in the actual physical tips. Now just be mindful that your tips may vary in length. So you may need to just kind of go into the various images just to do a bit of tidying up of the formatting, etc. But I think overall, this is a fantastic time saver. Now, when I click continue, you will then duly see that there it is. It has essentially selected each of my 10 points and then I can click on generate the 10 pages. And now you'll see what happens. And this is the beauty of the bulk create in Canva. So as you can see, it's brought in tip one. It's brought in tip two. If I just open this up more, you can see it all. So there you go. It's literally it has brought in each of our 10 tips onto that graphic. Now, obviously, if you wanted to, um, you know, funk it up a bit, certainly maybe change the coloring or some of the graphics at various intervals. But you see already the speed at which that can be done rather than having to create 10 different designs, which would take much longer. That's a matter of minutes. And that's how you use the Canva bulk create. So I hope you found today's Twyford tip useful. If you liked this video, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell 
do leave me a comment down below if you like this content or there's other types of content you'd like me to look at and create. And I will be back, of course, with more Twyford tips very soon. Take care.